too. Uh, okay, so this is like his lair then. I guess before he comes back. Quick, 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 quick. I think he's right behind me. He is. What was that? Amygdala arm? Amygdala arm? Go, 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 go. <laughs> I kind of want to fight him, but at the same time, is it really worth it? You know? It's always a question in the back of my head. Is it really worth it? Pretty sure I grabbed everything. Alright, that looks like everything. Just making sure. Alright, get the fuck out of here. I have no reason to fight that thing right now. No reason whatsoever <laughs> to ever fight that thing, actually. Unless it drops something insanely good, but I'll come back for that. When I haven't wasted all my blood vials on everything else. <laughs> Cover. I'm just completely covered in blood. I think that was everything that I skipped past. I believe it is. Because I got that, I got all the areas over there, I believe. Actually, there's probably one thing I'm missing. Uh, now I need to check because I'm doubting myself. Look, dog. Climb. Climb like your life depends on it because it really does at this moment. Haha. <laughs> Aha! <laughs> Alright. I think there was one spot over here that I didn't uh, catch. And that was right over here. Yows! Uh, that hurts a lot. No, wait, I was over here. This is where the uh, butcher stuff was. Never mind. I have been everywhere then. Excuse me. Excuse me. Go this way. <laughs> I probably need. Eh, I, don't, I guess I don't need blood vials. I haven't really died that much. So. I still should have like 200. 200 ish. Good. Welcome to the Blood Starved Beast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> While hacking all over the place. <laughs> Seriously. You got the optional boss? Sweet. Oh, yeah, you're on your level 45, dude, aren't you? GG. And I did pick up a new badge. I wonder what that gives me. What was that? Delayed Molotovs? Delayed Rope Molotovs. Actually, now that I think about it, I think there was one place that I missed to go. Oh yeah, here's Amandal Alarm. I'll check that in a sec. Ganley Guns. Nothing there, nothing there. Okay. I think it was the Molotov and Rope Molotov that I got from the badge. Uh, 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 McDonald arm. Arcane. It starts with a C strength scaling. Arm of a small amygdala, great one. Of a small amygdala. Strictly speaking, the amygdala arm is no trick weapon of any sort, but certain madmen wield them like clubs. 
Zerath is a large but tough blunt weapon formed of bone, but when extended, the hand quivers as if it were still alive. No, I wanted to actually put it on. Pretty cool. <laughs> oh, you switched your 100, your strength build. Ah, stop, stop, stop. <laughs> And you can cancel that part of the attack out, too. Oh, you can cancel it by moving, too. Or does it go off of stamina? Oh, I gotta see. No, you can cancel it by moving. Alright. Interesting. Cool. I wonder if that has it extended. Pretty cool weapon. <laughs> We're the gig OP. It's a weird weapon. Yeah, it looks like a weird weapon. It's strength, but also arcane. It's interesting. Mashup. Doesn't seem that viable. It looks pretty viable to me, but I guess everything that's sort of weird and uncanny is viable to me. <laughs> it's kind of the person I became in Dark Souls 2. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I guess I'll spend it on b -b 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 bullets. And I'll grab any access. Ah, shash. Uh, fire paper, gold paper, I didn't use any. That's about it. I'm trying to think. Did I miss something? Not that I can recall. If I did miss something, I'm sure I would find it eventually when I run back here for one more scouring. But I want to continue. I don't want to sit <laughs> at the beginning and try to find every little thing at the moment. I kind of want to see if I can beat another boss. Hello, sir. There's 
It's also these items, man. These new items that just kind of showed up. Oh yeah, I was gonna change my fashion too. I haven't really found a weapon that I like too much here yet. Unless there's a weapon you guys think I might like, or should give a try. <laughs> Yeah. Merc with the host. Thank you, Merc. Alright, let's see what these weapons are. Or weapons, items. The lethal damp bludgeon. That's a new one. Lethal. King Cold Blood. What a waste. What a waste. Okay. Lethal, lethal. What does a lethal one do? Lethal. There it is. Uh, that's it? Cool. Roll the gig obliterates bosses. <laughs> You're like level 73. I don't think level 73 is bad. Well, what's your stat allocation? And what weapon are you using again? Crickhammer? Plus 9? Dodge, dodge, dodge. One or two weapons left? That I may like? Or one or two weapons left in total? And I may like one of them. <laughs> uh. I'm sure you guys are all followers of Merc, so I don't have to tell you guys to go check him out. But if you guys don't follow Merc, or have never seen him stream, check him out. Because <laughs> he's a cool dude too. And I enjoy his streams when I get a chance to catch them. I kind of wish I didn't give her the brain fluid now, because I wanted to read that. Ah, damn it. Whatever. You love, you learn. I suppose. What's going on? Yeah, can I get your blood yet? What's Hello? going on? Hello? Is anyone there? Please. Somebody. I need help. I'm trying. But I'm afraid the sound is fading. Hello? Is that who I think it is? Please. Please, I need brain fluid. The sticky sound is fading fast. Oh no. Please bring me brain fluid. I must have it. That sound, it is all that guides me. Without it, I'll be sent back to my former, lesser years. So she needs more brain fluid now. Brain fluid. One or two that I may like. Sounds like a good deal. Because I'm thinking, what do I have? Technically, this is better. But it's also split damage. It's also plus 10. <laughs> I'm thinking... Uh, let's see what I... Apparently, this is supposed to be good. I didn't actually show off the full moveset either. I haven't gotten a chance to see if this has potential or not. That's pretty fast. Blame Fruid, yes. It's rolling attack. Rolling strong. that. 
And then I've shown off the other thing too, so. Oh, that's pretty sweet, actually. one thing I forgot to check. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Too bad the boom hammer doesn't have anything like that. I don't think I checked this one, though. This is a two-handed. Yeah, that's the L2 for that one. And that's it. I think we got... I think that was it. I mean, we have this one too. Might as well check it out. Lawnmower on a stick mode activated. Still not sure what I want. Out of those weapons. I would say the amygdala arm is probably the most curious one for me to check out. But I don't think it seems practical in PvE right now. This is supposed to take me to this door. Since that hunter has completely destroyed me a couple times. What? When you go naked snake, you may make my liquid snake go solid snake. <laughs> God, if this is a boss room, safe has a nice odd, had an odd nice move set. It seemed pretty standard. I will love the weapon you get from the final boss. <laughs> I guess we shall see. Yeah. Oh, hello living failures. Look, it's me, I'm in a video game. Oh god. So you're gonna be like three of them or some shit? Four of them? Five of them? Alright. Yo! I don't think you're too much of a failure if you can use magic. There's a third one. Oh my god, are they just gonna keep spawning? Holy shit! Oh my god! Did they just keep spawning? What is that fucking attack? Oh 
Oh, fuck me. <laughs> fuck me, am I right? <laughs> Is this the four kings? We have lore confirmation that the four kings are living failures. <laughs> ah. I hear one behind me. Yo! out of there. <laughs> God damn it, dude. How many of them are going to be here? So many. What the fuck is this attack now? Living failure is my ass. Failures at what? Not ganking me to death? Yo! <laughs> Why is there more? We're almost done with this fight. God damn. Astro Clock Tarky. Your worst enemy is yourself, and I have overcome myself. I'm gonna give myself a pat on the back. For that one. <laughs> For King X fight. <laughs> the music is pretty nice. Yeah, so far the music has been really good in this DLC. Well, the game itself. FromSoft just does really good music overall. I like the music in that one, though. If they wanted it to, to be true, Little Feelers, it should be a bunch of fat middle aged dudes in the arena, would have been a mom's basement. <laughs> 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 
just having like bleeds all over you. Oh, is this the boss you were talking about before? I hear the bell. Wait, is this a boss fight already? I'm not ready, dude. Hold up. <laughs> I'm not doing this fight without uh, 20 blood vials. I, I think it might be. Might be the same composer. I don't even have enough for one. I, I have to have enough. If I use... Not enough. <laughs> Not enough. There we go. Welcome. Very well, let me. Yeah, I have enough now. Farewell. Excellent. Lumen Wood Garden. <laughs> they couldn't call it the Lumen Garden, because I'm pretty sure they already did. Stings the nostrils a bit. <laughs> Paul and can fight my kind of gal. Alright. Maria. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me there, who are you? She kind of looks like, what's your name? from Dark Souls 2. Who's the NPC that always wore the mask? I don't really remember any of the Dark Souls 2 NPCs because I really didn't care too much. It started with an L, didn't it? She also looks like not alive. She looks like a doll. Inspect the corpse. Lucatio, that's right, yeah. The shaky hand. Blah. A corpse should be left well alone. Secrets beckon so sweetly. Only an honest death will kill you now. Liberate you from your wild curiosity. Idia Maria of the Astral Clock Tower. All right. <laughs> wow, she's fast. Trying to get a grasp of her move set. Pretty fast. Ah. 
The attacks that look like they charge up don't seem to have a follow-up yet. Here we go. Okay, so those ones are a bit longer. Well, range, yes, but they're also a bit longer. Uh, delayed hit. So two sword mode, dodge immediately. Uh, dual blade. Wait until she reappears. So far, that's what it seems like it's gonna be. She's probably just gonna change it up immediately, but <laughs> that's kind of what I got from that fight. So let's see if that helps out. I didn't even have it in the right mode. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> get up! Holy shit, man. There we go. There we go, we get a fucking gun, finally. Okay, now, now she's gonna use her gun. Alright. Damn, even that one, too. Alright, here we go. Let's see if that hypothesis is correct. Oh, I see Evelyn. I think I was just a bit lucky on that one. Jesus, man. <laughs> the range is pretty ridiculous, too. So I almost have to dodge, even uh, when she's close quarters. Alright. So far, so good. I'm just gonna do a practice run. See if I can get a grasp on her. That's a good time to strike. If I didn't back away. That one you gotta wait a second. Alright. See how she reacts to gunfire. Sure, I'll take it. Any more moves? <laughs> In fact, actually, whenever she disappears like that, I could probably shoot and get her coming out. fall for that, don't I? She doesn't like gunfire very much, though. I can tell you that. <laughs> Ow. Alright, just getting sloppy now. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I want to practice you on this mode a little bit more. See if I can get your timings down.
Good night, Merc. Thanks for stopping by. <laughs> uh, dual swords. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Looked at Czech for a second. Something about the same voice actor. What was that? Same voice actor? Oh, she's a doll in your opinion, because it's the same voice actor. Alright. What new tricks do you got at half health? More damage? Poisoning, maybe? Whoa! Oh, I'm so glad I dodged that. Ow. Alright. So now I just gotta be careful for range at that point. So what I should be doing is just practicing dodging all the time. <laughs> at that point. Should probably grab a drink. I'll grab a drink after this next try. I say next try because I don't think I'm going to beat her this time. Getting practice though. God damn it. I'm pretty- I was pretty sure I dodged, but I must have clicked it just slow enough. Oh, I should test out her stagger in her second mode. Ooh, damn. I was thought for sure that I was gonna get her. <laughs> My bad. Oh yeah, let me grab a drink now. <laughs> Give me one second.
All right, I'm back. Uh, what's up, Groudon? What's going on? 25% damn, dude. Alright. <clears throat> I also got a... For you, those of you curious, it's an apple cinnamon neutral game bar now. I like switching between strawberry and apple cinnamon. Eating Nutri-Grain bars and Dr. P. Taking too many hits. <laughs> what happened to the good old days where you actually tried to block? Tried to dodge? I'm trying this new method, it's called tank everything. Seeing if it works. This probably hurts, doesn't it? Don't- what are you doing? So there is a range to that. God damn. Weapon at risk, oh fuck! No, 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 no. Fuck. Can't believe that hit me, actually. <laughs> That's impressive. Ow. No! I messed that up so bad, that was it!
I liked that fight, actually. I actually liked that one. I gotta go fix my weapon now. <laughs> I'll use her echoes to fix my weapon. GG. The celestial dial. Wait, is this the clock tower? Hold up, that thing in the sky that I was saying, is this it? Okay, let's look at this celestial dial. <laughs> this is your favorite fight in Bloodborne? I actually really enjoyed it. A boss that was a character. She honestly didn't really seem overpowered either. <laughs> well, I guess it's hard to tell. Like, you could actually, like, stun her. She wasn't, like, some perma, unstunnable fucking NPC with god range. Dial for the Great Astral Clock of the Grand Cathedral. Celestial so dial that functions with the a giant astral clock in the Grand Cathedral. When the dial is held up towards the astral clock, the clock will come to life. Reveal a secret to its curious interloper. Okay, let's uh, click on the lamp. At least. I guess this is the clock. Oh yeah, right there. Oh yeah, I see this too. Flower petals everywhere. From just outside. But then there are these flowers that she like put here. Yeah, it's not super hard. I feel like it's got a, a fair balance in it. Praise the sun. That's not Kinghurst. It's just a mountain range. Is that a pirate ship? Yo. Pirate ships. Right, I need to go fix my weapon. Last boss and the optional one are mind-numbingly brutal. Is it gonna be like the daughter of Cosmos? Am I gonna be stuck on her for like a whole day? A new game plus four. Ooh, yeah. That'd be difficult. And I suppose if it is optional, it's probably going to be very difficult too. Damn, both of these fucked. And I did say I would use a new weapon, so. I mean, this holy sword. I kind of want to try it out, but at the same time, I really don't, you know? Mostly because it's another fucking Moonlight Greatsword, or it's a moon another Moonlight Sword in the game that they brought back. But it's also Astral, or Arcane Damage, which I don't feel like would be very useful in this area. So is the Amigdalen Arm. C E D. What is this thing? D D D D C. What else did I pick up? This thing, which 
It's kind of kind of cool, but not cool enough for me to want to use. B E D. C E D. <laughs> this is the only thing that's not split damage that I've picked up so far. What I really want to do is get that bow. I want to get the fucking uh, weapon that turns into a bow. So I think I'm going to save my stuff until I pick that up. Kind of really want that. <laughs> Looks so cool. Now that I look back at it, it was all luck. For a couple hours. Yeah, I feel like whatever this final boss is, everyone's saying is difficult. Apparently Ludwig was supposed to be really hard too. He only took me about 10 tries. I wasn't really keeping track. It was around 10. I know it wasn't more than 15. Or 12 at least. No way. Alright, well now I'm here. Aw, I want to go to the pirate ship though. Bill, it's a second city of Xanarkand. This is cool beans. Okay, this is not <laughs> this is not the great thing in the sky, I guess. Zane or canned. No wait, see, because there it is. No wait, now that's. Let's look at that again, real quick. Now it kind of looks like a moon, with a little bit less stuff in the way. Still some things though. Wait a minute. That isn't a sunken city. It's like we're above the cathedral ward. That's what it looks like, to me at least. Maybe it is a sunken city. The architecture looks very similar to the Cathedral Ward, though. And, like, here. Like, that's probably just a reflection there. But it's, it's kind of hard to tell what everything else is. Wait, you what? What was that? I missed something. I was on the last boss for days. Then I learned the Whirly Gurg. <laughs> the Whirly Gurg L2. I was very hesitant to do this on my main character because I've had such bad experiences with Dark Souls 2's DLC on my new game, Plus Plus. But so far it hasn't been bad, but that could be because I've been spending a lot of time with my stats making it look like this. Because I was, remember I was just doing Chalice Dungeons for the fuck of it. Because I honestly like the game. My biggest complaint was that there wasn't enough variety in weapons and armor and stuff. So I was just like, yeah, Chalice Dungeons I guess, because I don't want to play through the story again. Thank god I didn't play through the story again. <laughs> And now we got new weapons, it's perfect. I hear a bell. What the fuck is that? Uh, he kind of looks like that one thing from the Chalice Dungeon. Doesn't he? Maybe? Excuse me, sir. What are you? You're not an enemy. Bergenland. Bergenland. 
Oh, now that I've uh, done the clock tower, uh, I could probably go talk to those other people. By the wrath of Mother Goss. Mercy for the poor wizard child. Mercy. Oh, please. It's all meant for the wretches. Lay the curse of blood upon them and their children. And their children's children forevermore. Each wretched birth will plunge each child into a lifetime of misery. Is that why it looks like this <coughs> person or woman has something been ripped out of them? Bergen Rith. By the wrath of Mother Goss. That's something. Yeah, they all look like that. Nothing here. Alright. They're gonna put like pitfalls or something in this level. <laughs> There's barnacles all over the damn place. The fishing hamlet. Was there gonna be a giant fucking whale? Giant whale. Glowing maggots. Hello? Whatever you are. I heard a thing. What the fuck? What is the thing? Wow, so we're bringing mythical creatures into the game now, huh? At least they stun easy. Look, Vials. Was it three tries? Yeah, it might be three if you aren't counting the, uh, the one death where I was just trying to learn the moveset. I wasn't really fighting or anything. I feel like it was, like, five. I don't know, I wasn't, uh, keeping track, really. <laughs> Then again, guys, then again, you guys would know better. I'm really bad at remembering things. Alright, so there's just a bunch of corpses with maggots all over him. <laughs> New game, level 150? Wow. Oh. Blum, 
I might sneeze in a second. I'm sorry if you hear a loud noise. I don't like this glowing shit. What is this? This looks like a trapped room. No, nope, I guess not. Go up there though. What? Huh? What the fuck is making that noise? Stop making that noise. <laughs> Good flip, flip, flip. PvE bill. Yeah, so is mine. I was just saying 150 on new game. Like, did that take you a while to get? So I'm on. I'm 168 and I've basically been leveling up constantly. Well, I guess I've gotten to a point where I stopped really caring about my echoes. Yo, can you fuck off? Holy shit. Okay, so there's a shaman here, I think. No, it's just fucking evil spirit house right there. What the fuck? I don't even know what that is. What's even doing that? Yeah, there's a guy or something. All right, so it takes a few seconds afterwards. Alright, go, go, go. No, what the fuck? I, th I thought it was based on the timer. Alright, at least I can grab this guy. No! Alright. Now, let's see what's going on over there. It looks like... That guy? Get off the corpses. Guy, I think. Hell no. Come down here. Okay, that thing is really weak to fire.
Just new DLC, small, or is it new disc? The short thing made me shit myself. <laughs> Oh, because Gore likes to host fight clubs at that level. Oh, because he hosts fight clubs, so you just want to have an advantage because you're a cheater. Gotcha. Does he usually have fight clubs that have a level limit, or is it just kind of whatever? Like, hey, I'm doing a fight club. Fucking, let's fight. Goodbye. Probably felt him up there, didn't he? Tried to ambush me. Has never beat any Souls game. Uh, so far it seems pretty lengthy. I mean, I've been playing it for five hours now. And, uh, I'm not sure how far I am or how much content I've actually found in-game. I say it's a necessary addition to the game, though. The base game felt a bit lacking, and this I think this is gonna help complete the game. What? Is there something behind me? Or my you just playing tricks on me again? Okay, there's totally a ladder right there, too. What's ah! <laughs> Dude, I was like... Wham! Wham! Hold on a sec. Who's that awesome person? Heretic. Heretic, hold on. I need to move that too. And get to a safe spot real quick. Heretic, with the one dollar donation. I see you've met the Murdoch's one hand. Thank you for the donation. I really appreciate it. Thank you for being in the stream as well. And just another reminder to everyone, on Friday I'll be starting Majora's Mask. I'm sure if you like Majora's Mask, or if you like me suffering, Friday's the day to be here. <laughs> flip plop. Flip plop, flip plop. Usually 120. <laughs> Gore's your roommate. Oh, nice. Uh, when did that happen? Is that pretty recent or? I'm in unfamiliar territory. Oh no, I'm right outside here. Never mind. Not unfamiliar at all. Six months ago? Oh, six months ago. So like June. <laughs> I didn't know you moved you guys moved in together. Right after you finish first year of college. Congrats on finishing first year of college. <laughs> I couldn't do that. I'm too dumb. Kinda wanna see what's ahead before I go down. What the fuck is this pile of garbage right here? Oh, the hunt is nice. My zombie has AIDS! Uh, welcome back. It's probably been like a month since I last saw you. A month or two.
move to Texas. Yeah, I, I saw that he was uh, having some uh, tough time. He was having some tough times, uh... Oh, shit! Around the same time that I was uh, about to move, too. So I couldn't really help him out too much. Otherwise, I would've. But zombie, how are you? Sometimes I just lurk. No problem with lurking. No problem at all. What would you? Whoa! Oh, great. You know what's worse than fish? Dogfish. You've got to be kidding me. What the fuck is this place? Look at this guy. Hey there, buddy. What are you doing? Just hanging around. That's cool. What's your friend doing? He doesn't look so well. And your other friend, too. They don't seem to be doing as well. You good? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty good. Alright. No, I'll, I'll leave you to it. No! <laughs> ah, these are spear guys. More spear guys. Yeah! Yeah, oh my god, of course. <laughs> Screaming dogfishes, right? This is like Brigginworth Woods. No! Oh. Ah! I see, their whole thing is to stun. Yeah. Shut up. Get out of here. <laughs> Freaky fish man. Where? <laughs> Where? I heard you. Is that you? Over there? This sucks at Bloodborne. Is there... That's me going all the way, all the time. You finally got the connection, Jorm. <laughs> what connection? <laughs> um, Miglash? Yeah. You should see my luxurious skill. What is it like? Did you do him without getting hit at all? Oh no. Try this again. It seemed to work. Ah, there's another one of these fox. Are you kidding? Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Uh, he looks like he has a weapon. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Yeah, uh, yo, uh, ho, uh, yeah, um, yeah, about that. I would appreciate it if you calmed down a little bit. Yes. Wow, okay, not even that is safe. <laughs> Could you fuck off, holy shit. Ah! <laughs> Rip. <laughs> he 
Yeah, YouTube live streaming is a thing. It is. The guy has super wonky in boxes. Yeah, he does. Looks like it, at least. Alright. I'm gonna try not using that, the writer, the whole time. I do have other weapons. This is actually my stronger weapon, so... Getting my ass kicked, though. Yo. I hate this fucking skull shit. Featuring the skull unit. At least these guys drop blood vials like there's no tomorrow. Oh yeah, I do want to check this out too. I don't think I can get back up though. Oh no, I can. Uh, maybe I... Yeah, maybe I don't want to go down here. <laughs> Never mind. I wonder if there's a minimum amount of bullshit I have to get through. Sorry, this is just way more efficient. Ow! Who? Who? What? Where? Oh, up there. Yo, what the fuck? What are you doing? What is this? No! Get up! Oh my god, what a waste. Run. Well, see, this would have been fine and all, but I decided to be a fucking douchebag about this. God damn it. God damn it. And now I have to go through this building. Yo, I swear to God, dude. That's the last time I tried to skip enemies. <laughs> this is no time for sitting. <laughs> Let me just take a sit. It'll be fine. <laughs> God damn it. That's some tracking you got there, sir. Ow. He better drop like 10,000 blood vials. <laughs> Since I had to actually fight him. Better been worth the trouble. 
Oh my god, I fucking look at chat for one goddamn second. <laughs> I completely forgot this guy was here. I thought it was just a dog up here. Dog. I say dog, but what is this thing really? It's like, it's more like a fog than a dog. It's like a fish dog. Fish dog, fish dog. Oh, I got my stuff back, so... Servers are back up. Are they? I need to get the new update, though. I don't have update 1.08. Unfortunately. My PlayStation decided not to get that, after it decided to get 1.07. Woo 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 Spooky skeletons shivers down my spine. I like your hitboxes, man. And I appreciate what you're trying to do. But please, can I pay you to fuck off or something? I really don't want to fight you. I kind of want to see if there's anything. Okay, he must- no, he's not guarding anything. He's just standing there like an asshole. Oh, fuck. I'll go in the building. Hey, look, it's a lamp. Okay, there was a thing there. I heard you. Hello. I just wanted to get this. Hi? Who are you? I'm afraid I've made a bunch of things. Farm chunks. Oh, I can hear the bell now. The beast hide assassin. He's after me. Again. Oh, I missed it. What did he just say? Again. It never ends. <sighs> farming chunks. Where do you farm the chunks again? I... I used to remember. Wah, wah. Sorry, it's like really dark. Donation hype! Wah, wah, wah. Zombie, thank you for the five dollars. Really appreciate it, man. Uh, no comment on that one. But thank you for the five dollar donation. And thank you for being in here. Good to see you again. Please. I need you to do something. Uh oh. This village is the true secret. Testament to the old sins. It feeds this hunter's nightmare. Please. Bring to an end the horror. Oh, okay. So our forefathers sin. We hunters cannot bear their weight forever. It isn't fair. It just isn't fair. Yo! Simon! Oh, dude, sweet. <laughs> sorry, sorry, Simon, but thank you for dying. But also at the same time, no! Your drill was the drill that was supposed to pierce the heavens! Underground cell, inner chamber key. Key to the inner chamber of the Grand Cathedral cell. Oh, was it. Ooh, I know where that is. Key to the inner cell below the Grand Cathedral, innermost chamber, underground cell holds lone man man. Where he wears a beast hide, rings and rings a bell that emits no sound. Unending death awaits those who can hear. The Unending death awaits those that can hear the soundless bell. Uh, okay. Maybe I should just tell him no. I can't hear it. This is the bow blade, isn't it? It goes off of blood tinge too. Fuck. I knew I should have been continuing to level my blood tinge. This is it, isn't it? Hold on. I, I just want to see. It is! This is the weapon I wanted. Wait. Okay.
That's pretty cool, actually. It doesn't really have much in the way of uh, attacks with the bow. Cause, but, I mean, what can you really do? What about this? Dude, that's pretty sweet, actually. <laughs> What a cool-ass weapon, dude. Holy shit. This is everything I've ever wanted. Cool. I might actually upgrade that. Because that's the weapon I've been actually wanting to get in the DLC. Let's go back. Bubblehead Hyde. I knew this would be a weapon you wanted. It's the weapon I've wanted to get my hands on since I saw it in the trailers. I'm not usually a, a long-ranged fighter, but this thing looked interesting. I wanted to try it out. So let's see what we can get on this thing. Let's see how good it is first. <laughs> oh, I have a rock too? I don't know if I want to use the rock on it though. I want to see if it's worth it first. What is its base? Base of 287. Burial Blade is pretty... it's good. But not as good as a fast weapon. Right, right. Let's see what we got on here. The skill scaling. Skill scaling S. Better attack. What was this? Attack up, blood attack down a little bit. Overall, better. <laughs> Alright, triangles. Usually something like this. Or that, actually. <laughs> oh wait, I actually have a good triangle for this though. HP gradual decrease. For nine more attack? I... nah. I, I don't want to be spending my blood vials on actual PvE. Maybe for PvP that'd be a good one, but PvE, I don't want my HP just draining constantly. No thank you. I guess I'll put that on. Anything? I think there's a lot of stuff that's better than that. Yeah. Like attack up. Attack up. Alright, how does it fare now? I mean, compared to the Burial Blade, it's gonna be pretty good, I think. Ooh, it's almost on par with my Rider. What, how close is it, exactly? It's about 23. I think that rock would actually push it over. Oops. I'm also curious if this bow actually, uh, if this is a parryable thing. Like th that looks like a, s a stun parry, maybe? I don't know. Guess we'll see. Do I have enough to actually level though? Very well. Whoa, it skipped all her con- it skipped all her dialogue. The blood tinge scaling is apparently not even worth it at that point. It's my right hand one. Plutage doesn't even help. 
I do want to level my blood titch though, so. Farewell. Maybe on the next level. Maybe on the next level. So that's fine. What's this? Seep is for the city. Debating if I should sleep or continue watching you. You could lay in bed and have my stream up. Then you could fall asleep watching me. Oh, there's an idea. <laughs> or you could sleep because you probably have school in the morning. <laughs> they fall off the ledge. You can parry with the bow. Nice. Does bone marrow ash work on it? <laughs> I might as well spend these. I'm just gonna lose them. Okay, I didn't think so. <laughs> that would have been weird. And uh, here, I'm gonna go back here real quick. Because I rang the clock tower, I want to see if anything actually happened. Oh shit, I can hear the bell now. Fuck off, holy shit. These guys are dead. These guys are dead. He fucking dodged that like a goddamn madman. <laughs> How the hell was he able to run? You cheater! You cheater! I like his armor though. Nice! That was a complete accident too, by the way. I thought the beast was supposed to be hard. Bradder's testimony. Alright. So did he escape his cell then? Yeah, he totally escaped his cell. <laughs> I don't want to be near the anti-tentacles near the water. <laughs> oh no wait, it's not open actually. Hello? 
Well, well. Look who's here. Welcome to my quarters. I've never entertained a guest before. What are we about to fight again? Are you going to kill me? After all you've done, kill me. As if to right your wrongs. <laughs> well, I wasn't going to, but if you're about to fight me, then I have to, right? What is it? Aren't you going to kill me? Or perhaps beg my forgiveness? What? I ain't gonna beg for fucking forgiveness. Well, leave off. What's done is done. <laughs> uh, nothing in these rooms then? I feel like if I attack him, he's gonna turn into some fucking badass beast. Nothing changes. Such is the nature of man. Jesus, Trump, what'd you do to the guy? <laughs> the blood ladder. Oh, you get the weapon. Oh, we got a new weapon. Let's look at this thing. <laughs> I can't even use it? You need so much blood tinge for this. Demented wa hunter weapon brandished by Braidor. Bradder. Healing church assassin. Oh, that was the assassin that the other guy was talking about. I saw the word assassin, but then I missed the rest of the sentence. Butler assumes it's terrible. True and terrifying form. After it draws upon blood from the inner reaches of one body. Oh, that's why he spawned in with missing health. Hey, get it. Oops. I want to see this helmet, though, that I picked up. Scalp of a horrible cleric beast. Indicating that Hunter Rider, a healing church assassin, had killed a compatriot. Afterward, he bore his ally's own scalp and hid himself away deep below in a cell. The church provided him the single soulless bell of death to ensure the secrets would be kept. Decent. Not my cup of tea, though. Was that, uh, it, I guess? Locked, still. Everything's locked. Can, are you gonna open your door? Or not, I guess. <laughs> I'm also going to check under this, because I was going to, but I was also told that there were items down here. Ah, I see it. It comes up like that. Inspect the surgery art. Lawrence's skull. Ah. Some fucker kicked you off the ledge. Skull of Lawrence, first Vicar of the Healing Church. Skull of Lawrence, first Vicar of the Healing Church. In reality, he became the first cleric beast. His human skull only exists within the nightmare. The skull is a symbol to protect a symbol of Lawrence's past and what he failed to protect. He's destined to seek his skull, but even if he found it, he would never restore. His memories. It wouldn't. 
Is this gonna kill me if I uh, do this? I feel like it would be odd if this brought me into a fucking dead zone. Yeah, I was gonna say. The church. Oh, so that's what that one guy was using, the church can. I was like, it kind of looks like Ludwig's rifle. Jesus, man. Oversized weapon by the healing church. Type of cannon that fires a curved trajectory and creates an explosion. Originally designed used from by brawny men with, with deteriorated brains, not just for some ordinary hunter. But the men lacked the wits to effectively operate firearms, and the weapon was quietly ushered into permanent storage. We didn't look at the Gatling gun either. Highly customizable portable version of the stationary Gatling gun operated by the old hunter Duro in Old Yarnum. It was the weapon of choice of the youngest of Euro's uh, three companions. His name would be Gatling gun. It was exceptional fire, rapid firing functionality. It was considered a cumbersome weapon due to excessive weight and insatiable consumption. Quicksilver bullets. I heard this thing only takes like a bullet like every three seconds. So I've gotten that stuff now. Oh! Wasn't even paying attention. I should have figured that the bow was gonna take... <laughs> the bow was gonna take Quicksilver bullets. <laughs> I don't know why I thought it wasn't going to. By the way, do I have what I need to get in here? Locked. Hello, sir. Someone. Dropped him in a puddle. Is this even the right puddle? Or are you just kind of psycho? I kind of want to go back and check that well, but I'm probably just going to push forward a little bit more. Because I feel like it's going to loop around. There was a... Oh. Hello. You don't even talk to me anymore, you just skip the dialogue. Hunters have told me about, but I am with you. Of course, I do, isn't it? Farewell, good mate. Welcome, what it? Okay, now you said it that time. I was wondering if, like, <laughs> if that was a bug or <laughs> if I actually did something to offend her. Like, killing Maria made her stop talking to you. Lighthouse hut. Lighthouse, huh? Drum get on the servers. Not today. Not today. I like soloing my first, my blind runs. Anyways. No, Simon. Shimon! Oh, yeah, of course. I'll probably be on the servers tomorrow, though. Okay, cool. Blood. Look at this fucking place. Like, what a mess. Uh, 
Big eye in the sky. Help me, please. Big eye in the sky. Okay, it's the moon, but it's also the astral clock. Like, o overshadowing it. Right? It kind of looks like that. I thought it was some weird, like... I thought it was, like, the clock tower or something before, but it almost really seems like the clock tower now. Oh, this isn't even a path. This just goes here. This is your favorite level? Reminds you of Blight Town and Val Valley of Defilement. The rain. Was it raining in Blight Town? Maybe I don't remember it. I remember Valley of Defilement. It was always like dripping. Like it had that rain effect, but it was just like all the garbage and crap just dripping down. Bloodied armband. Oh yeah, I forgot to uh, change fashion. I keep forgetting about that. Sorry. Uh, down, down, up, down, up, up. I guess we'll go up. Guess we'll go over here first. Didn't rain in Blight Town. Okay, this is like a whole big, like, fucking. It's a big old fucking big fuck stone of fucking fucks. What's down here? I feel like there's something giant's gonna pop out. Man, so many splits. Old damn blood gem. <laughs> Gosh, so many places to go. Do I drop down? Do I keep going? Oh, there's another guy throwing stuff. Oh my god, dogs. Hey. Oops. Not where I wanted to throw it. I guess I'll drop down, but I don't want to drop down with all these dogos. Guess this is the safest place to drop down from. It's plus two. 
Yes, I'll get that fucker to get me off the ledge. Sorry, not gonna fall through your trap. I already activated it. Three chunks, nice. Very nice. Two more chunks, very nice. <laughs> that those spears hurt way more than the dogs. Now that I've actually been hit by a spear, take out about half my health. Probably more. Probably a lot more. <laughs> Not this way. Let's go back. I wanna. I wanna. I wanna go. See that fucking thing. Ow. That doesn't do anything. Ow. That's a chunk, nice. Wanna go down the well. So much ruckus up there. Wait, is there anything even here? Looks like it gets pretty deep in some places. I can't even see the floor. Wait, there's nothing in this room at all. It's kind of worthless. The only thing is the drop down. Okay, so I have to come back here later. Wait, where'd you come from? Oh! <laughs> oh! Try to get them off my tail, I guess. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's just hanging on the ceiling. Didn't even notice him. Alright, I think I'll go in the room filled with fishmen. I'll go... it's up here, right? Yeah. I'll go in here this time. Any more of those guys on the ceiling? <laughs> Yo, hail Helix. Yo, yo, yo. I'm not seeing any hailing or praising in chat. Oh, that's it would have taken me down there, right? I'm guessing, maybe.
been a while since I heard that. <laughs> like, Demon Souls. Fucking 2-2. Two, two. I couldn't tell if he was an NPC or not. He was making some puffin' and puffin'. And I was, I was there to hear him out, but... No words, just violence. Get out of the way when you die, please. <laughs> Next time you die, try to die a little faster. That was the slowest death animation, I think. And you just had to do it there. Ladder. A door that doesn't open from this side. Actually, this one does. Because this goes back to the... right here. And then there's this fool. These fools. What are they doing? Like, finding, like, helixes to excavate? Is that their job? It's actually probably something like barnacle scraping. This isn't a safe room. Look at... Look at that. Look at that shit. Oops. I guess I gotta keep my eyes out for those... things on the ceiling. I wonder if I can walk on this stuff. Does it hurt? Oh! These are actual things now. Whoa! 